Good morning, THS. It's Monday, November 7th. I'm Madison. And I'm Matthew, and you're watching Viking News. The THS Student Council is hoping to distribute 100 baskets to families of our school system students. Baskets will be distributed on Monday, November 21st. Each basket contains enough food for the entire Thanksgiving break. If you would like to participate, please speak with a student council member or one of its sponsors. Daniel, Jonah Berry Memorial Toy Drive kicks off tomorrow. New toy donations shall be accepted through December 4th at local food city locations. Our students are touched by the efforts of this holiday project. Elementary advanced students who are not currently served by other holiday charitable efforts are given toys from this drive. THS Civinets support the drive through the collection of new toys. The THS Athletic Department will host the Winter Sports Meet the Vikings on November 14th. This will be held at, in Viking Hall at 7. Cheerleaders, boys basketball, girls basketball, boys swimming, girls swimming, girls wrestling, boys wrestling will be recognized. Fresh Club members, if you are interested in a club t-shirt, please bring $12 to Madam Toby by Monday, November 7th. No extensions will be given. Thank you. Students in Leadership Challenge are collecting socks for the elders at Broadmoor. They will be also be collecting donations from anyone that would like to help. They're collecting blankets, game, word searches, games, lotions, bathing items, or anything that could possibly be used for a Thanksgiving basket. If you would like to help out, please contact Gretchen Estevez, Kelsey Shores, or Alexis Terrell. Now here's Gracie and Sam with your weather forecast and cafe watch. Good morning, Tennessee High School. I'm Sam. The weather for today is a high of 73 and a low of 40. Now back to the studio for cafe watch. In sports news, Tennessee head football coach Butch Jones said Monday during his weekly press conference that running back Jalen Hurd has informed him that he has plans to transfer to another school. Hurd had told his teammates he plans on playing tight end or receiver for another program. Hurd told his deci decision to 20 teammates and that most of them already knew about the, his intentions to transfer. In local news, Bristol, Tennessee police were transported a juvenile to court Monday afternoon when he escaped from their custody. The 16-year-old was being transported from the detention center to juvenile court. The teen was supposed to appear in court on several charges, including unauthorized use of vehicle, false reporting, and driving without a license. The 16-year-old was taken back to the detention center. A new court date will be set for him. In national news, the polls are tightening, the election map is shifting, and Donald Trump still faces a narrow path to the White House. Analysis say the first time convention-defying Republican presidential candidate has a real shot one day from now. That's all for Viking News. Have a marvelous Monday.